Hello Clippers, I am your host Trojan Santiago and you're tuned in to Clip TV for yet another edition of Trending Clips. I know, I know all of you are excited to wrap up the week because of the long weekend due to the holiday on Monday, but as for now, I want you to sit back and relax because these are the top stories of the week. Six hundred fowls up for bird flu slaughter in Pampanga. Random drug tests for high school students and teachers starts next month. And the nine-year-old Filipina continues to stun America's Got Talent. Authorities are set to cost 600,000 fowls in San Luis, Pampanga as more poultry farms give up their flocks for slaughter after suffering heavy losses due to a bird flu outbreak, according to the Department of Agriculture, or DA, on Wednesday, August 16, 2017. The department was supposed to slaughter only 200,000 poultry heads from six farms inside a one-square-kilometer quarantine zone in San Luis, Pampanga. However, Department of Agriculture Secretary Emmanuel Pinol said in a press briefing that 30 more farm owners volunteered to join the depopulation to prevent the spread of the virus and minimize further losses. According to Pinol, authorities have called about 73,000 birds so far. He also said that the DA needs at least 52.8 million pesos for the depopulation process as it has promised to pay poultry racers 80 pesos for every culled fowl. The department has sought the deployment of 100 soldiers to help in the depopulation and has asked the national police to boost quarantine stations. The Philippines have managed to remain its avian flu-free status for the longest time in Asia in about almost 20 years. But all that ended last August 11 when some 37,000 birds have died from avian influenza subtype H5 and was declared as the first bird flu outbreak in the country. The Department of Education, or DepEd, on Wednesday, August 16, 2017, announced that teachers and students of all public and private high schools nationwide will be subjected to random drug testing starting in September. DepEd Secretary Leonor Briones said during a press conference that the drug testing for junior and senior high school students would be held outside the school premises. Briona said that the drug tests would be done mainly for prevention and rehabilitation purposes only. She said that the results would not be reflected in the students' academic records and would not be a ground for expulsion and disciplinary actions or any criminal proceedings. If a student is found to be drug dependent, they will be referred by the school to the Department of Social Welfare and Development or DSWD or a social worker for counseling and intervention. The random drug testing that will be conducted is said to determine the prevalence of drug users among students and to help the government's efforts to strengthen the fight against dangerous drugs. The nine-year-old Filipina Angelica Hale continues to dominate America's Got Talent by taking it one step further as she left the audience in awe during the live show performances. Hale performed her moving rendition of Zed's song Clarity and had one of the judges and former Spice Girl member Mel B reduced into tears. The other judges had similar glowing reviews for Hale's performance, with Simon Cowles calling her a very, very special girl. Outside of the judges' table, Zed chimed in with his own comments on Twitter, describing Hale as crazy talented. Hale first impressed the show when she performed her powerful rendition of Rise Up as her audition piece. She then earned the coveted golden buzzer during the judges' cut round for her stunning performance of Alicia Keys' Girl on Fire. This good is on fire. And that's it for this week's episode of Trending Clips. But again, before I go, make sure that you follow us on our social media accounts. That's facebook.com slash clip.tv on Instagram at clip.tvph 
And on Twitter, tweet us, hey, at Cliff underscore TV. Or subscribe on our official YouTube channel at Cliff TV for the hottest news and updates. This has been Trojan Santiago. And you have been watching Trending Clips. Bye-bye.